I was having rice quail because I was feeling thirsty. I'm hungry. I didn't take even my lunch right now because I was very busy on my present moment and uh, I used to making a lot of videos for the viewers and subscribers because they are waiting for me and I have to do something. Again, I will take rice quail. Would you like to have it? Even if you don't, then have normal water or mineral. But we guys, people people have rice gruel. Cheese. Do we express about my parents' journey a little bit for a while? Okay, let's do it. Just wait, I'm just getting ready to speak, okay? Because I'm not prepared for it. Then also I have to speak something else that I want to say with my viewers. What's up everyone? How are you? Hope you're doing well. Today I'm gonna to talk about something else that I want to make you to improve something else and understand the English language or any language. Dear friends, here I've come here with five tips which will make you so confident that do you really think that I want to become fluent in English? Do you really think you want to learn English like native from native American, native Britishians? Do you really? If you really want to learn English, then don't worry, I'm here to help you and uh, this is the present moment, this is the time and it's time to learn English together and uh, grow together. No worries don't think about it okay dear friends today i'm going to share with you five tips do you know what are those five tips to become fluent in english and uh, how did i become fluent in english i just follow these five tips and i did when i used to uh, learning english in my initial stage i used to follow these five tips and worked harder than the hardest day and night and then today i'm speaking a little bit not more I don't think I'm speaking more, but at least I'm just giving you the information about English language. That's enough for me and I'm feeling very proud of myself. Trust me. Friends, five tips are those reading, writing, listening, speaking and watching. These five tips will make you so confident and uh, build your confidence to speak English like native fro. Trust me. Reading. When you're going to read books, you have to read again and again a lesson, not another lesson, okay? Just read any lesson every day and just change one lesson and uh, in the another day, you have to change another lesson. This is how you have to read any day, okay? Any books. You can read newspaper, you can read novel books or any other books, whatever English books you can read. Just at least read a book. And then, you have to listen podcast english audios tedx speakers listen to tedx speaking english any speeches you have to listen every day and watch watch english movies with subtitles because if you couldn't understand or if you couldn't find out any meaning of that word or sentence then you have to just turn on the caption and watch the subtitle and you have to repeat it while speaking out or by noting down about all of that sentence or that word okay and you will use this sentence or word while making a good conversation with somebody else while sitting at home next speaking speak even a single word or sentence a day at least you don't have to sit idle all the time every day speak at least even a single word in english a day because it will uh, it will make you to open your mouth and uh, brings you many many confidence and colors within you and uh, write write english 
what all do you write whatever whatever you have to write from books from the newspaper while watching to the TED speakers or English speeches listen and write or do anything whatever you write you can write in English or story writing and you can write a letter you can write application you can write about uh, some motivational story about anything whatever you want to write you have to write at least one page a day because that will bring you more confident and enhance your vocabulary and enhance uh, enhance your sentence to build a different kind of sentences and uh, you know it will change your mind and uh, brings you mindset so we have to write at least one page a day dear friends whatever i share with you i did everything and these five tips are followed by me and i followed these five tips when i used to learn english when i was in my initial stage i did and i become plain in english and right now i'm just speaking a little bit in front of you and sharing with you guys these five tips if you want to follow these five tips then it it offs you and if you don't then let it be because I need you I want you to speak like native fro and like me and if you want to learn English while sitting at home because I'm just saying with you guys who all those who cannot go to the educational institution outside I mean to the city town they don't have enough money they have financial accounts so this video will be very helpful for them because who all cannot go to the town and uh, learn English so if you want to learn then it's it's very humble for me and uh, very good for you and uh, it will bring you different kind of colors like uh, you know um, your bright will be your future will be bright and uh, you know everything that I'll, if you don't know English then you will be full and uh, you know such people think about you that guy is full and uh, he is ignorant most of the people will cheat you and uh, you know they will laugh at you so we have to be more confident by ourselves not for others and uh, we must have at least a language learning whether you follow these five tips or not i don't know but you have to just follow the five tips to become fluent in english dear friends do you really want to learn english then you have to just follow these five tips because these these five tips are very very helpful for me and they helped me a lot because i did all those five tips when i used to learn english in my initial stage and uh, if you follow these five tips and work hard in the hardest up to three and four months you will see a significant difference within yourself trust me guys and uh, you will see your happiness within you and uh, you will become confident in english and wherever you go you can survive everywhere because you know english if you know english you can survive everywhere and communicate with the uh, abroad people while sitting at home without any effortlessly uh, you know it's very good language and uh, worldwide language if you want to connect with somebody from one place to far away then it will be very helpful for you even you can connect with foreigners and uh, you can speak with them effortlessly and because you know the tips and tricks and uh, to manage and to express uh, you know to make good conversation because you have good communication skill and many more things you know about so even you can speak english if you follow these five tips and uh, work harder than the hardest so i request you to follow these five tips and become fluent in english so till then goodbye and take care see you soon in the next episode bye and take care see ya